hello everyone today i'm going to deal with one of the topics which has given headaches to both parents and teachers when the children that is small children of the age group of say 7 8 years are asked to write the dodging tables this is the topic i am going to deal with today it creates confusion in their minds and they start counting the tables from the beginning for example if they are asked what is 16 into 7 they start counting from 16 into 1 16 into 2 and so on and if they have not memorized the tables up to 20 then it is very very difficult for them to write the dodging tables and most of the teachers find difficulty in dealing with this topic and parents struggle at home spending hours and hours together with small children telling them that they have to memorize the tables and this creates lot of problem in higher classes when the children have to carry out small multiplications and they do not memorize the tables at the basic level so today i am going to tell you one way through which you can minimize the these problems which arise due to not cramming up and memorizing the tables and how a person can teach his child to arrive at the product directly without actually counting the table now for this you know the base work has to be done from right from the class kg onwards when the child is say about 4 years old and from 4 years to 7 years that age is very very crucial for development of a child in terms of his numerical ability in terms of his being comfortable with handling numbers so there are some essentials which have to be taken care of before the child starts these dodging tables in class 3 onwards so i am going to tell you what are the essentials of dealing with this topic now there are basically two broad essentials which have to be taken care of the very first one is to build a strong base of oral addition and that to oral addition i am talking about oral addition of single digits like you have 6 plus 7 13 and so on if the child is comfortable in adding single digits then this forms the basis of all dodging tables so parents work on your child's oral addition from the base from age 4 onwards 4 years onwards and you have to keep on working for the next 2 or 3 years so that when you arrive at dodging tables the basic concepts and the essentials are very very clear to the child the second one is the tables of 2 to 9 that is again single digit numbers so if the child is having comfort in dealing with the tables of single digits and adding the single digits together then this is sufficient for enabling him to write any product from in between the table of any two digit number say up to 30 now i'll demonstrate how this these two concepts help a child in the dodging tables now this is for the parents for the teachers kindly follow this method to teach the child the dodging tables do not pressurize him to memorize all the tables up to 20 25 30 and so on now first example which i am taking is very small example of 12 multiplied by 3 12 threes now if a child is asked what is 12 times 
3 or 3 times 12 he starts counting the table 12 ones are 2 12 uh, 12 ones are 12 12 twos are 24 and so on now if the teacher applies a small concept now he can teach the child to write this product directly now the product which has to be taught to the child is not actually the multiplication or counting the table of 12 what he has to do is the first step is the number here is 3 so what he does is he writes 3 and puts a 0 whatever number is there here he puts a 0 in front of that number and then he finds the product of this number with the ones place only he forgets this one and multiplies this number with this only so here comes the tables of 2 to 9 so this is 3 into 2 3 to the 6 and now he has to just add 30 and 6 which will give him 36 and if a parent teaches this well the teacher brings in this concept at the right time in life of the child I think this concept can work wonders similar examples now say we have the same table of 12 and he has to multiply it by 7 apply the same concept again 7 so he puts a 7 and a 0 and just he multiplies this by 2 so now he knows the single digit tables so 7 2s are 14 and even when we have to add 70 and 14 the child has to be taught not to add like this he has to do this also mentally and for that again we apply the same rule here the tens digit is 7 tens digit is 1 7 plus 1 is 8 and again he puts a 0 and what is he left with is this digit 4 now it is very easy to add 84 so you see two small steps and the problem gets solved if we have some other number say we have 13 multiplied by 4 now again when you see the number here is 4 so the child has to be told that this 4 has to be suffixed by a 0 and then he has to just multiply 4 by 3 that is 12 and for adding these he has to add these two tens places 5 then again put a 0 and then add this digit 2 so 52 10 minutes of practice of this concept will enable the child to write any dodging table up to 30 let us take some bigger examples say we have 14 into 6 now see this number is 6 so we put a 0 and we multiply the 6 by 4 6 4 the 24 now tens digits 6 plus 2 is 8 put a 0 and add this unit digit so 84 let us take one more bigger number so that we are convinced that this method will work out for any larger number also say we have 17 into 5 now we have 5 here so 5 supplemented by a 0 plus 5 7s are 35 see we need single digit tables now for adding this tens digits 5 plus 3 is 8 put a 0 and write this number so 85 see even the parents will feel comfortable while teaching this concept because when you are con convinced yourself about a particular concept you have confidence in that concept 
and you can confidently teach the child how to deal with dodging tables. Now let us take one more example of say 18 to be multiplied by say we have to multiply by 6. So now here it is 6 supplemented by 0, 6 at the 48. Now 6 plus 4 is 10, put a 0 and add 8, 108. More examples, say we have 19 multiplied by 8, 8 put a 0, 8 9 the 72, 8 plus 7, 15 put a 0 and add this to 152. What else we require? We have such wonderful gifts which have been given by mathematicians, uh, books and lots and lots of knowledge is stored in our books. But we fail to understand those concepts, we fail to take time to study those concepts and practice it. We feel comfortable in cramming up and memorizing the concepts. Think of a child who does dodging tables like this and who is able to solve all these multiplications orally without any use of calculators, without any use of writing. See, I have not written even a single calculation on the side in the rough work. This everything has been done, has been done mentally. Please understand this method. It involves very small two steps and that too very very easy steps so kindly follow these parents teachers teach your children like this in order to inculcate the habit of good reading in them keep enjoying keep learning and share and subscribe the video if you like it